What is up YouTube? Welcome to this Arrow video. So we are careening into a very interesting showdown between Prometheus and the Vigilante. But we really haven't seen much of Prometheus in the last few weeks, which is pretty upsetting because it's pretty cool seeing this badass do all kinds of crazy shit on this show. However, we have seen a lot of Oliver's bae, Susan Williams. Now, Susan Williams has proved to be a very interesting character on the show. Now, many of us, before this season actually aired, we expected the former popular alumni to actually be the herald that would bring us the Green Lantern, because, well, she is related in the comics to the Green Lantern, but it looks like this is not going to be what we will be getting this season. However, we do have a very interesting character who is having a relationship with Oliver, but she's also screwing him over by actually investigating him, and he's very close to working out, if not already, that she does know that he is the Green Arrow. So it's not looking good at all for Oliver, and I'm unsure as to why she's actually getting so close to him and falling for him, but all the while working with the human target to work out what he's getting up to. Now, Artemis is a very interesting character as she is one who turned on the team and was kind of working, I would say, undercover on the team. But what is interesting is the fact that she actually turned on them to work with Prometheus and well, it wouldn't be something that I would have expected. Not the fact that she would have turned. That was a bit surprising, but it's not uncommon in, well, any kinds of these stories that one of the team goes rogue, and it's kind of like the Teen Titans storylines. But here, she actually started with Prometheus, someone who is hell-bent on causing chaos and trouble for Oliver, the Green Arrow, and, well, he doesn't really play well with others such as Killer Frost and Tobias Church. Now, what if all of this is a ploy? Now, I was thinking originally that Susan Williams was actually working with Prometheus, but it doesn't look like a very good idea if we look at Tobias Church. Now, Tobias Church was actually a very, very interesting character, and I thought he was a really, really cool villain for the show, but he really didn't actually last as long as we expected. I expected him to be the big bad causing all the trouble this season with Prometheus working the strings from behind. But it didn't work out that way one bit, did it? Well, it did for a bit, but Tobias thought he had done well by working out just who the Green Arrow is. He worked out that it is Oliver, but that was not what made Prometheus happy one bit. He was not happy and decided to off him for the whole reason that he wanted to be the one who knew he wa who Green Arrow was and didn't want anyone else to know. Now let's take a look at someone else who actually knows who the Green Arrow really is. Now clearly the plan from Prometheus is to cause all kinds of issues for Oliver Queen. Now, Tobias Church actually wanted to kill Oliver and put the Green Arrow off of the chessboard, so to speak. And, well, what would happen if the information was actually leaked of the identity of the Green Arrow? This would cause a lot of problems, and Prometheus wants to be the one who would actually cause his death. And, well, I'm sure a lot of other people would be interested in this knowledge as to just who Prometheus is. And I don't really think that Susan Williams is working with Prometheus. I think that this would be a bit too obvious and a bit too convoluted of a storyline. But I do think that Prometheus will bring the arrow down upon Susan because she is actually doing these things and possibly jeopardising any plan that Prometheus actually has to cause Oliver all kinds of issues. So no, I don't think she's working with Prometheus, but I think that she is in the line of sights for Prometheus to kill her once he finds out what she's actually doing. So this was a theory that was actually brought in my video before, and I thought I'd expand upon this, because I've seen a few theories that she's actually Prometheus, which I don't really think is 
something that would happen to us one bit. But I do kind of like that theory. But that's it for this video. Please drop a like. Please subscribe. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.